All right, back into the ugly modified, and uh, probably not going to be great since Eldora is top dominant and uh, really right on the wall. I've done a little bit of practice just to make sure I can run up there, um, but most likely we'll be three quarters of the way up. It's kind of Riding around doing our thing for the number three. So maybe we've got a chance, but probably not since this is only the second race I've done in these in a time. So we got some practice, we got some heat races, and then we'll go to the main. But let's hop out there and see what we can go for speed. Passing, I assume, is going to be very difficult to do. I don't know why, but the car is way looser right now than uh, in practice when it was slicker. People trying to win practice and going up and blocking a high line. But we'll just come down here and uh, see if it is possible to get anything hooked up down here. We'll at least uh, avoid them wrecking each other. Or if someone gets in the wall. bottom there, but whatever. Fourth quickest. Seven is the quickest, so don't know if everyone has been out on track. Just move around, try a few things, because you're not going to be able to get the line that you want all the time. And, uh, yeah, not too worried about finishing dead last here. I assume with how broken the uh, wall hits are that, since we don't have the new damage model on this, that people will be getting up into it and not really having much happen, but someone hits it hard off the corner and gets ran into, hopefully being a little lower will help us avoid that mess. At least the track is slicking off. I grabbed the front stretch wall and that just really screwed me up. So the more the top side slicks off right now, the better it is for us. Or the worse, I guess. Because that's just going to make the top even more narrow and harder for me to hit. But hey, there we go. Now we're racing like everyone else. Now we're dirt racing on iRacing. Although it actually slowed us down because I lifted off and pulled the right front over. So, we're fourth quickest, but Enjoy that number while we can, because we're heading off to qualifying and it's going to be different.
think goal is just hope that we get a long run again and people burn up their tires. As long as we're not flat footing it and uh, eating up the tires, maybe we can get the middle and bottom to work. I don't think the top in three and four is actually good. Wasn't good though. Right now though, pull. Oh. There's the flag. It's over. Someone's got to go beat that, right? Yeah, lots to go. Well, we did pick up quite a bit. Well, not quite a bit, but four tenths, four hundreds, four hundreds. But we still got the one and the two to go. One's not in here, though, so... Let's see. Good, or are some people just going to start at the rear so that they can go through the field in the heat races? I need to refresh paint schemes and make sure we have a TV cam set up. Well, we are still at the top. I don't know why. I mean, I guess this is a very low strength of field if I'm the number three, but the number one's not in here, so we're actually the second best. What's this guy's I rating? 3,800. 1,000. So... Uh, looks like he accidentally got pulled. That's scary. Means I'm going to have to run the high side. Just try to run that line that I did there, though. High in one and two. Then, uh, slightly below the slick in three and four. But there we go. That is a pull. Our second race in the modifieds. Uh, paint scheme. It was easier to get them to load up here when everyone was out on track. A little bit nervous about this. Um, just because. We probably don't need to be on the front row. More than likely, I'm going to just run it into the wall and uh, cause a big mess. But if we can pull this off and get lucky, pain, maybe we'll be able to move up to limited late models and 358s way sooner than I thought. But I'll still run the modifieds, especially if this is a good race, because that uh, Lima Land race was freaking awesome. But ugly paint scheme on the front row. Never a good sign for the field, at least in real life. One to go. Next time by. Get a good start and clear this guy. Get ready, going green. The pace car is in. Green, green, green. Get the good start. Now, can I get it through this corner without hitting the wall? We can. 
third place got ahead of second. I just need to not get too loose in three and four. Four and one and two. That was bad. Oh, that wasn't good. Have one here in a 358 before. 17.0885. Five to go. Five cars kind of closing in, but he just got. Nope, that wasn't him. I thought he got in the wall. That was a bad, bad corner. He's working just a little lower and going a little quicker than us but I've not been very clean up here. starting on pull for the A main. So, even more unexpected. We got a good jump, which really helped Victory us, but... See you in Victory Lane. That will be nice. I mean, that was a little boring, wasn't it? I don't know how fast people go out and just win every race. That's got to be the most boring thing to do. Like, start at the front, pull away, never actually race anyone. I don't know how people do that over and over and over. That is one advantage of not being fast, is uh, at least enjoy these moments where you can just relax at the front. We'll take a look and see how this one goes, see where the fast guys are running. We got 30 laps, and cautions will be on for the A. Two car knows how to start them, hanging back. And I've not seen, has one car, no, nope, one car has not joined. So he's gonna donate some I rating. Let's see how this one goes. Green flag, green flag. car up into the wall, free light off of two. It's actually a uh, weaker field than what we had because we got most of the 8, 9, 13, 12, and 10, so looks like we had a stronger field. Let's just uh, take a look and see the line he's driving. Nine cars got to run, so he may be the nine. I guess he's a 2,300. He's working the high side really good. He's going to go to the bottom. It's a fairly good drive through there.
that he's not going to head back there. Not seeing uh, any bad moves or lines being changed. So we might be able to get a clean A, although a little bit of a, uh, we got a battle for the lead. Although now the 13 is flying up there and he just blinks out and nine is going to put it in the wall and lose that spot. 13 is chugging now. He's got the high side hooked up. Nine's back in the wall. Coming around for the white flag. The two has went down to the middle of the track. Thirteen gonna throw it in down lower. Is he gonna stick with the high side? He sticks with the high side. He's not gonna be able to get around there, but he made it really close. Nine got himself back there and uh, was a good heat. All right, well, 30 laps. All of us on track. Can I put it together? Kind of interesting to see the two go lower. Go last lap. Be able to move around and kind of see where the speed is. Time to roll off though, and oh, this is another good one. Line up on the inside. Pit road is closed right now. For some reason, on dirt and I racing, usually the wider tracks are much worse because people do a lot of stupid stuff. The steering feels really broken right now. Okay. I think I'm better now. Sometimes coming off the pavement, it does some weird stuff. One to go, next time by. All right. Can we go all green? That would be awesome. Green, stay focused. Not gonna ride him up into the slick. Just ask him to get turned. The pace car is off. Be ready. Better good start. Green, green, green. Now we just gotta get through one and two. Not a good drive off the corner. And way too sideways, losing time. Just driving in the slick at the moment. Need to relax, get in rhythm, not put it in the wall. Alright, calm down. We're in third. Just dropping backwards. Should have went lower, I guess. But. We'll get it solved. Clean racing, though. Well, until I put it in the wall, and now we're just stopped in front of everyone, and I am terrible. Luckily, the guy behind me hit the wall as well. Fuck, I am bad. Alright. We need to get down. Car 
Really good racing up front. We're getting ran into. We just got nothing now. We need to run just a little higher up. 13's getting the high side to work. They're four wide for the lead. I mean, we're still green, and it's been great racing, so I don't care how far I drop. This has been awesome. Got a four come up in front of us. Everyone's kind of moving back to the high side. Team's just bouncing it off the wall on entry. Hope this guy doesn't cut it down off the corner. find some grip off the corner. Oh, now we got our first big dumb move by the nine. And... Of course. Caution, yellow flag. Line up, single file. Pit road is closed. You knocked your wheels out of alignment. Good Let job to the nine. Overdriving his car. Flag came out. And now we're broken. Catch up, 11, car. Well. It looked like it was going to be good. And then, uh... The nine does one stupid move into the corner and then loops it or does a slide job and gets hit. And then is all of a sudden parked in front of us, so. Nothing we could do there. And then everyone just trying to win the race under yellow plows into us, so. Oh well. We got a heat race win. Pit road is closed. But yeah, we're, we got a hood pin floating. We're going to be down on power. I'm guessing this thing is going to blow up before we even get to the end of this one. One to go. Next time by. Line up on the outside. Catch up. Seven. Car. But maybe the nine will go wreck some more people and get some spots. About to go green, stay focused. No point in us even pulling up there. We're gonna be down on power and who knows how this is even gonna drive. Green flag, green flag. Maybe being down on power will help us. The 9 has wrecked, and the 12 decides to not go to the top of the track. Off the corner, apparently.
down here and hope. It's not like too screwed up, but off the corner it does some weird stuff. There's some weird like handling hobble that it's doing. I can't get anything down there. Long ways to go. Sadly, everyone's just able to bounce it off the wall and be fine. So, we're not going to get any spots from that. The 11 is over rotating in the center of the corner. We got to watch out for him doing that. And maybe get one more spot back in the top 10 of a what 13 car 12 car race Struggling. Got the seven who has broken something. And we get to get and we have to let everyone back. By. That's awesome. Oh well, one more time for them to wad it up, although that's it going to be, it'll probably be single file, so they probably won't. Nine car wrecked himself out and got last, so at least that happened after whatever the hell he did. I mean, after seeing that slide job, and then he just appears in front of us from the top lane sideways. I'm sure it was another attempt at a slide job and got hit. Pit road is closed. But, uh, yeah. A lot of damage for us. Gonna have to, uh, put a new front end on this thing. One left to green. Yep, single file, so nothing's gonna happen out of this one. About to go green, stay focused. <laughs> Car is off. 
Did we hit the time limit or did Because we never got the white flag. Maybe we didn't get the white and I didn't notice it, but Yep. That sucked. Go from pole to dead last. Let's uh ooh, take a look at everything that happened out there. See a lot of wall slamming, but that is that showed our true speed there. Track was completely different from the heat race and just running too high and made too many mistakes. Lemon comes up, gets the twelve. Yeah, that's realistic. With the uh, fender being a solid chunk that you can just bounce the car off of. Seven hard into the wall. It's just either hitting it absolutely perfect, which you should never be that high where that is anyways, or the wall is pushing off on his fender because he's raced at such an angle, and so it just holds the car up. Yeah, I mean, look at that. That was a true hit, and he passes everyone doing it. But don't tell that to the fast guys. They'll say, no, that's not that's not how it is. Even though we can all see it. Now, that's what happened. The four got into the nine. But the nine actually checked up, and then terrible hitbox because yeah, he was hitting the tire. So yeah, the nine actually checked up. So we won't blame that on the nine. But after seeing yeah, and then I hit the brakes, and the car just turns right for some reason. It just like chucks my car to the right. We kill the four, then we're backwards, and we get plowed into, and that. That is some damage. Nine up into the wall, and then him in the eight, and then he turns down and gets the ten, and... Eight and four get together. Comes off the corner faster than us after doing that. Four and the fourteen get together. Seven car, possibly. Now oh, he is way off pace and then gets hit. 
and pulls it down and then gets hit and stops. So that is what brought out the caution and then nothing after that. So let's uh, take a look at results. And we lose 47i rating. We gain safety rating after all that, because dirt racing is absolutely pathetic on what they call clean racing. Um, <laughs> and, uh, yeah. We, uh, well, we led one lap, so that's good. But absolutely pathetic after that. So, disappointing. Went from feeling really good to dead last, pretty much. So, hopefully it was fun to watch, and uh, we'll work on it and get better. But probably not coming back to this track, since it's just wall ride. Even if you screw up the high side and hit the wall, you gain speed like you saw the 11 do. So, it's pointless to race this more than once because I'm not going to race that way. And uh, go do 305s and dirt street stocks later in the week. Thanks for watching.